All right, welcome to this video. And uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna break down some more Doc Watson licks from Deep River Blues. Uh, I think you'll really enjoy this. I'm gonna do it thumb and one finger style like Doc. And uh, so I'll do a little performance and then we'll go ahead and break it down for you. Okay, so here we go. So, I'm going to start off with this E7 chord. Okay, so first finger, fifth fret, E string, uh, B, B string. And then your second finger, sixth fret, D string. Third finger, seventh fret, G string. And your pinky at the seventh fret of the high E string. So, should sound like that. And then you move the second, third, and fourth fingers down one fret, leave the first finger where it is, right? So, so that gives you an E diminished seventh chord, okay? And the melody is, and the bass notes are, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna slide from this E diminished seventh back to the E seventh, and when, you, when your fingers hit the E7 chord, the end of the slide, you're gonna play the low E string like that. Okay. Whoops. And then you play the high E string by itself. So you go. And then you're gonna grab an E7 down here, you're gonna slide to it from a D sharp seven. Okay, so this the this chord, the fingering is first finger, third fret, B string, second finger, fourth fret, G string, and the third finger, fourth fret, E string. Okay? And you're gonna do a pinch. So you're gonna grab the E and B strings with your first finger and the third string with your thumb. And then a pinch with the high E string and the low E string together. I, actually, I forgot one thing I wanna point out. So this here. So you're playing E, B, and if you can, get the G string. It's like a strum with your first finger. Okay. Open E string by itself. Slide into this. Uh, E7 with a pinch, right? And then another uh, pinch with the high E string and the low E string. And then we'll go to the next uh, chord shape. So. so here you're gonna make an A7 shape. You, we still have to finish the bar of E. So this last E I'm playing here is the end of four on that bar of E. And then there's your, the next lick on A. You're playing the A string open and then the G, the seventh up here with your pinky third fret E string. So you're gonna go play this bass note when you hit the C sharp, when you do the slide from C, you hit the, the bass note when you hit the C sharp like that, okay? It's a little tricky. And then the high E string, which is the and of four on that bar. And then there's your one of the next bar, which is on A now. Okay, now, so this lick, you just hold this e, uh, A7 shape, and then with your pinky, and then you play the C sharp, which you're already holding. F sharp with your second, uh, your third finger at the second fret of the high E string. The open A string, and then this little lick, and you're back on E. So, okay, so. So 
that little lick is you're just playing the E. So second fret B string. So so and then if you're picky, then you play the F sharp up top here, second fret E string while you're holding the, the B7 chord. Okay? That's a pinch. You're playing the B and the F sharp on top while you're holding this B7 chord. Right? So. So I'm just going on the B string, third fret. And then the open B and the A, which you're already holding the seventh of the B7 chord. Okay, so that's the lick there, right? So. Okay, and then back to the lick. So that little lick there, uh, so uh, you want to go like this, right? So. so I'm going low E string, fourth fret on the E string with my picky, open A string, B flat, and then B. Okay. So the melody here is... I'm holding a B7 chord, so I'm going 2nd fret B string, 2nd fret A string, open B string, and then 2nd fret B string again, and then back to E, right? And then here I'm just doing a, I'm playing this bass note, the 2nd the fret of the D string, I'm, I'm playing it and then playing the G string open and then hammering on the first fret, right? And then high E string open. And then pulling off with my third finger at the second fret of the B string. A nice little lick there. Okay. So there's a couple more variations. Uh, I could do something like this. So what I'm doing there is I'm playing this little shape here, right? So I'm going uh, open E string, then playing this um, C sharp, uh, fourth fret with my second finger, fourth fret on the A string and third fret uh, G string with my first finger. And then the high E string open, so. Move it down one fret, same, same uh, position. So when you get down to the, to, to the E, uh, you've got kind of an E7 shape here. So you wanna play the full E chord, right? Uh, for that last, uh, for the last note, right? So. And then I do that pinky, the pull off with my pinky at the second fret of the B string. All right. So um, I think that's quite a bit for now. Uh, I'll leave that with you. Um, I'll, I'll be making another uh, a video about Deep River Blues. I got some other cool uh, little licks, but I thought this would be good for today. Let me know if it helps. If there's anything you're iffy on, just put it in the comments. Um, I appreciate all the comments. Uh, and um, uh, so, yeah, so let me know if this helps. And I certainly hope it does. And I hope you enjoy it.
Okay, so thanks for taking the time to listen.